Good day everyone, good day Sir Craig, this is Aileen Kitingan and I will present a mathematics achievement and academic performance on the adversity quotient of senior high school learners. It is the thesis by Lovely V. Castro on October 28, um, October 2018, College of Education, West Visayas State University, La Paz, Iloilo City. So... His, in his in her study, the researcher used the data analysis procedure, the, the statistical tool, the descriptive statistics, mean standard deviation, inferential statistics, person product, moment correlation coefficient. And we are asked to critique the thesis, the table, and the paragraph follows what we discussed last October 8, 2022. 22. So, in mathematics achievement as a grade 12 senior high school learners in this section present the mathematics achievement of senior high school students or learners. On the average, see table 4, the mathematics achievement of the learners was satisfactory with a mean of 81 and standard deviation of 4.71. This simply means that uh, statistics Achievement of the grade 12 senior high school learners of the national high school is just satisfactory, not outstanding, but also not as weak as expected. When, uh, when according to the strength of the respondents, ABM got outstanding achievement with a mean of 90, standard deviation 5.78. This was already expected from the ABM learners, most of whom belong to science, technology, and engineering. Strand in the start section class when they were in junior high school. It was also followed by the Humes, with a mean of 85, standard deviation 4.93, and gas mean of 81, and standard deviation 4.81. Who, who both would have satisfactory achievement in mathematics. Yelson's class strand are also composed of learners who excel in class when they were in junior high school. Some of them have good attitude toward math, but there are some learners belong, belonging to this section who will find difficulty in the subject. So what I understand or what I have observed in this is so this is the table. So it shows first the paragraph and then it follows the table, the tabular, which shows the standard division and the mean. And then all the analysis of all analysis, the presentation, the table using tabular, then it's always the same sequence that first is the paragraph, then follow the tabular. Not what Dr. Craig presented as that first tabular, then the paragraph follows that explain the, the tabular. And also as what I have noticed that in the paragraph is the researcher will not just only focus on the highlight but it is repetition or repeat. He just um, the researcher mentioned the AB, the standard deviation in the mean of ABM, gas, humes, industrial arts, home economics, and overall. But also the researcher find that in overall it is satisfactory. The overall standard deviation in the mean all states that it is satisfactory. And then, as what also I have observed, it has no rank, which also Dr. Craig mentioned that if it's more than three, uh, more than two, three, four, or more than numbers, so it should have rank. So here it has no ranking. Then in his in her paragraph. It is only a repetition what as the table stated. That's all. By the way, this is a, again Kabinga Nailin M A M T with under the class of statistical method six zero three. Thank you.